Good morning everyone and my lecturer. Before I start my presentation, I will to introducing my group members. First, we have Elena, Elma, Aaron, Zul and me. Um, in this presentation, I will like talking about Sepagar Port. Sepagar Port is located in Sabah which as an interesting place and as a strategic place. Beside that, Sepagar Port spent almost 1 billion ringgit to build the port. Therefore, that's why Seoul Koreans is interesting to build the first product base in KKIP. Suddenly, Sepagar Port is strategically located along the busy shipping routine between the Far East and Europe. They are on the way to rationalize port operation across the site tag hubbing the create more robust economy of Shell. Thank you, that's all for me. Hi, my name is Elena Mendy. Today I'm going to present about history and background of port Tanjung Pelepas. The port of Tanjung Pelepas is located at Iskandar Putri, Johor Bahru. It is the fast, fastest growing container in world, world record. The, tan, the port of Tanjung Pelepas is part of APM Terminal. They start operation, operational in October 1999 and officially launched in March 2000. The port of Tanjung Pelepas handled 1 million, million tours in first 571 days and became the fast growing container in the world in world record. They are confused the main east waste shipping lane and also allow round the clock betting and offer Turn around time in 45th minute. Construction of the port of Terminal Tanjung Pelepas developed five phase over 25th year and up to 2020. The project began in 1997 and preliminary design in 1995 to 1996. The contract the by Paul Nadi. Thank you. That's all for me. My name is Aaron Dero Lawrence. I am from class 1F. Today, I want to continue my friend present. Now, I want to present about my topic is Sepangar Port. My first topic is Sepangar Port is located between Euro Fast 10 for because want to have a beautiful and strategic place. In addition, Sepangar Port has taken over the container port and cargo operation of Kota Kinabalu because Sepangar Port is the right choice in that location. For example, has a wide space and close distance. This is the reason why Sepangar enter many container. The next point is that Sepangar Port has achieved success after a major review <clears throat> not only that south korean has the first overseas product base in kkip because south korean is eastern in building the first base in kkip finally the sepangar port has a tank with a combined volume of 1000 cubic meters okay that's only for me thank you Tanjung Pelepas Port only handle container cargo. Container cargo means any strong enough, any container strong enough for repeat use, low temporary storage and protection of the items, commodities, and other cargoes. It can be transported using variety of modalities without requiring inter intermediate loading or unloading. is referred to as a cargo container. Tanjung Pelepas Port was the most modern container terminal in Malaysia. It's strategically located at the confluence of the Strait of Malacca and the South China Sea. 
So hi to my group member and also to my lecturer, which is Ashwita Kusavan, who teach us uh, subject Foundation English. And I will explain in... Uh, by the way, my name is Mohamed Zulfaq and I will explain in about the special characteristic of each port in uh, Joho and Sabah, which is uh, Tanjong Kulepas and uh, Port Sepanga. So first, we got uh, Tanjong Kulepas special characteristic. So first, sheltered bay without a tight restriction and wide surface and strategic location. This is a diff advan some advantage for, not some lah, it's a big advantage for Tanjong Pula Passport because uh, many, uh, there's a uh, many uh, container can they put at there. So, move to the, ne the next page. Terminal has depth ranging from 50 to 90 meters and also largest containers terminal also and we go we're going to uh, port spanga so first many containers that have been import or export to this port and able to carry large quantities of container at one time break wall record for highest utilization of a container vessel also this is a not about a uh container port is also uh, oil port so that's all for me Mama and thank you for let me presenting and also thank you for miss ashwita kusavan who teach us and that's all for me goodbye